Hi everybody, it's your favorite introvert here. Today, we're going to be going over what happens if your controller loses power in flight. We're going to be going over some of the return to home functions of the DJI Mavic Pro. So let's get into it. We're going to use this field here. We're going to go out to the middle of the field if there's no obstructions. No possible chance of magnetic interference. Squared away. What we're going to do is we're going to tap three dots up at the top right hand corner. And we are going to go to the drone page. We're going to go to the icon that looks like a drone up at the top left hand corner there. Alright, so up top you have your basic settings, your home point settings. On the left hand side, this is where you take off from. Set current aircraft position as home point. So where the aircraft is at this moment, that is where it's going to return to. So we're going to go ahead and select OK for this. This that's where we want to go. And our return to home altitude. Uh, I like to take a look around at my surroundings. Uh, basically, I have a tree to my left that's probably 50 feet tall. So 30 meters would be 90 feet roughly. That's a little too high. Let's set it to 20. settings are good. Okay. And we're going to exit out. So upon takeoff, it will set the home point to this location in the middle of the field. We're going to use the return to home button, the arrow pointing to the H button. We're going to select it, return to home, return home and land. Sounds good enough to me, so we're going to slide this to the right, and it should come home. Go home. All right, it's raising up to its 25 meters. Let's see how close it gets. Now, any time that you feel uncomfortable with it returning to home, you can take control of it. So like this. It's basically right above me right now. Landing. Now it's searching for its home point. This should be interesting. Let's see, see how close we get it. Not bad. So, what we're going to do here is going to walk over to the corner of the field. Let's hope it comes to this point. You have to set the controller point while in flight. So if you happen to move from the original takeoff location, then you set the controller point. When the aircraft takes off, original takeoff point is where its return to home is set. So to override that and return to the controller's point, where the controller's GPS is set, then you override it in the settings to return to home at the location of your controller. Pretty cool. So now the real test, and the part that I'm not really happy about doing, but I'll do it just for you guys. We're going to power down the controller while the Mavic is in flight. We're going to set the home point at takeoff. We're going to fly to the same point and location across in the corner of the field there. We're going to power down and see what happens. So let's give it a shot. We're recording. We're recording.
shutting down. Shutting down. All right, so I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions about return to home functionality of the DJI Mavic, leave it in the comments below. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you want more, please subscribe. We're gonna be having more videos of the DJI Mavic, as well as we have a DJI Spark on order, so it's gonna be in the mail soon, uh, and more Inspire 2 videos. So go ahead and give a subscribe, and hope to see you in future videos. Thanks for checking out my channel.